Hey everyone, Glitchy here, and welcome to episode uh, ooh, six of Don't Starve Swamp Living 2.0. On the last episode, we survived, guys. We survived. We built our bird cage. We got our bird trap all set up. We cut down some more trees that we can plant in a um, plant here and ensure that we have some trees close by when winter gets closer. Maybe also a bit of a uh, of a border between me and the swamp. And let's see, let's see what else we need to do. We need to we need to continue surviving is what we need to do. We have tons of meat. Now your bird, the pig king, and uh, Wooly, I believe his name is Wooly, or it's, it's either Wooly or Wally, do not take monster meat as is, but if you turn it into monster jerky, however, they will gladly take it. Your bird will poop out an egg. Um, you'll get, I believe, one gold for for the uh, for the the beef not beef jerky for the monster jerky you will also get um, a red feather among other items from the uh, from Wally. Wally or Wally? I know, he's the pirate parrot that you will find near a ship. Um, so he's obviously awesome. Because he's a pirate parrot. Like, <laughs> what's not to love? Um, I feel like the dudes that are over here should go bye-bye. Of course, we get another tentacle. Oh, yes, we have our bird. We have a bird. No, Pepino, not yet. Sorry, ladies and gents. Cat wants his attention today, and it's, uh, you know, it's just not, uh, not meant to be. At least yet, yeah, anyways. Um... I guess we're just gonna. Wow! Hi! Hello! You are awfully close to my encampment. I do not like you. Seriously? At least, like, my sanity and my health are gonna stay up because spiders are relatively easy if you just have, like, one or two of them to kill off. Um, it's when they attack in a pack and you get, like, their little spider leaders that, like, jump and they're green and they're. Oh, we got some more sploosh. Glomer's goop is actually really good as fuel. Um, we're going to save it for the summer as fuel for the ice flumomatics. I don't think we actually needed to use that much of that. Um, we are going to make... A, another chest to store our stuff in. Because we, we actually do have quite a bit of stuff still. probably store that in there and be fine for a little bit at least. You're gonna need more grass, more stone, probably cut down more trees and be totally fine with that. Hmm.
the sounds of the night. Reminds me of summertime. Got, you know, mosquitoes and froggy sounds and just delightful. Pap, I'm not going to tell you again. No, not yet. Um, let's see. We've explored quite a bit of that way, so we're just going to continue on this way and, uh, see what we encounter. Where is my axe? You know what, actually I don't want to axe anything in the swamp. I'd rather keep that stuff for like an emergency, like, oh I need a tree guys, I need a tree. Um, wow, we have no twigs, no twigs, really? Ooh, butt cheeks, we need some twigs. Looks like we're going to be tumbleweed chases today. Should we break down these rocks or should we wait for like rocks that have gold in them and stuff? Oh, that's doggy territory. We don't really want to head into dog territory right now. No. No, no, no. We don't come off that. Well, at least we have excess grass now, so that's always good. We still haven't found, like, any beefalo or anything like that, um, so I'm really glad we're finding, like, fur in case um, I do decide to, like, build um, or craft a... What is that? Oh, yeah, that's where that is. Okay. A, like, winter vest for ourselves. I'm also glad we live close to here because um, the cactus flowers to make, like, the summer frock, I believe it is, you can only get those like when they actually bloom in summertime so you want to be kind of close to them I love the music for Don't Starve as well I think it's flipping amazing Have, like fudge fingers today they're just doing whatever they want I do have a band-aid on now does anyone else feel like when they have a band-aid on that they're like just inept like they can't do anything because they have a band-aid on their finger I'm hoping I'm not the only one Alright, and that's that. Should we just cut down like some of these bad boys? Like, like I don't know. I don't know, but um thinking that might be a yes just because 
I want to get rid of this thing. We're just going to drop that because I don't use like the flowers or anything like that. Oh, I keep hitting the wrong button. Okay, so we have we have a good amount of wood now. I think it's probably a good idea to head back to our camp. Oh, but I see stuff over here I want. just because I don't use like blow guns too too often um, especially when we have so many spikes I just like using the spikes um, why build something and waste resources when you are <laughs> getting gifted weapons oh this is like this is like the tumbleweed spawn point just have to camp here. No, we don't. We don't want any of that juju. I always make sure to have like a prepared meal with me um, just in case I do have to stay somewhere. Um, it's just kind of good to make sure that like I'm actually not gonna starve and funnily enough like the name of the game is don't starve and I think starving is probably like the hardest way to die in this game because I mean except for like the very beginning like sometimes I've definitely come close to starvation with her but it wasn't like it was starvation induced death from eating too much monster meat to keep from starving and then my health went or something like that, or like just like my health was already low from starving and then I got killed by something else, so I guess it kind of makes sense. But at the same time, I just feel like the enemies are so much more of an issue than starvation. Um, but as I said, that's, that's, just, uh, that's just me. Can I burn these bad boys? They should, since they are dark petals, they should have, like, made it, like, a poof or something like that. Like, something cool. I don't know why my cam is, like, being such a butthole all of a sudden. Like, it, like, it changed its own setting somehow. Ugh. Off we go. I'm hoping we haven't, like, missed a bird and it broke free, but... No way. We have plenty of stuff that needs to be taken care of and dropped off, so... Dude, we are not keeping that. That makes your, ins your sanity go bye byes Dark petals. Oh, well that's like good timing. I don't want meat though. I'd much rather prefer like a feather. I also don't need to, like, take care of that. Alright, so we're, like, harboring turkeys in the swamp. <laughs> 
We've got a turkey farm, guys! I can't. That's just... Oh my goodness. That is just too good. Too good. We have a freaking turkey. Oh, excuse me, guys. Wow. Sorry about the yawns. Can't help it, apparently. Okay, so we have tons of, like, meat and stuff, but, um, hmm. I don't know. I think we need more bone shards. We have four. I also think we need more of that. Okay. Gonna go on a quest here. Um. I do want to get rid of the asshole tentacle that's like right here. Asshole tentacle taken care of. He's not re I mean, he's just being a tentacle, but, you know. You're a little too close to my camp. Like, I kind of just made the camp. And you ended up too close to it, dude. Sorry. So, you gotta kind of, like, kaputza. Like. Like, I'm sorry. There's really not much else to that. Now, the only thing about this is, is that, oh god. Oh god, it's almost winter. Oh my goodness, do we have, like, stuff? Do we have enough stuff? Oh my god, I totally lost track of time. Oh, man, we got, like, we've got, like, nothing. At least we finally got everything fertilized, I guess, but, like, oh. All right, let's, um, let's take this out here and make the thermal stone. Um, Chester, what else do you got in you? We'll plant these bad boys. I really don't know what we need feathers for, to be quite honest. Yeah, when I'm done recording this episode, butt cheeks. I really call him Kitty Whiskers, but um, he's being slightly <clears throat> annoying. Excuse me. Sorry about that, guys. Um, but yeah, normally I just call him Kitty Whiskers. Butt cheeks is not his official nickname. We're gonna need more stones. Um. Who oh boy. This could get ugly. This could get ugly. Alright, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Um. That's the end of today's episode, says my timer. Um. Right before winter. Oh my gosh. Um. Oh gosh, so next episode, episode 7, winter is here. It is no longer coming. So, um, you're going to have to get ready for the deer clops. We need to make some barriers. We got to get some damn rocks in order to survive here. Like, holy butt cheeks. So, stay tuned. Don't forget to follow the channel for more Don't Starve Swamp Living action, as well as other game reviews, walkthroughs, and unboxings. And watch me at twitch.tv slash glitchy TV for live gameplay and interaction. Thank you guys so much and have a wonderful day. Bye everyone.